I was looking up all my Lego Comic-Con exclusives, guys, and when I was looking them up on eBay, I have a, a minifig. It's called Sheriff Deadpool. Thousand bucks, my friends. A thousand dollars. So excited, man. A Spider-Man PS4 exclusive. Comic-Con exclusive. Five hundred dollars. This is on eBay, though. If you look on eBay, that's what people are selling it for in the package. They're still in the bubble. Thank you. You like the Mickey Mouse hat? Appreciate it. 45 seconds. Uh-oh. Look at... What the hell? Where's the hype train? Why ain't the hype train hype? Come on, kids. We oh. got to get there, man. There's 37. 36 seconds left. 37 seconds left. I went up in time. We're only at 42%. We're going to miss the hype train. We're Hurry up, we need an uppercut. Train. So we gotta pop in from uh, Smittles. He might pop back in before he leaves. Thank you, Powerhouse G, appreciate it. <laughs> but it was a skinny Bob and Silent J. <laughs> oh yeah. You get a little bit of everybody through sporadic through the through the streams, right? You have Mike from Comic Book, Comic Book Men's Mike Zapkilks. Also, comic book men's Brian Johnson. You never know who you'll see. Maybe you'll see one of these and one of those and Dante or maybe that guy named Randall one day. So, Alter Beast just said, Jay and Tom Bob's soundtrack, movie soundtrack, got him through some rough times in his teens. What's some? Yeah, Kevin said thank you too. Um, I don't remember what some of the jams on there. Yeah, oh, yup, yup. Bullets, nice. How many people want to kick so my ass? Do the skip it do. What is your yeah? This is from the show, right? Look at King Shark. What up, Milanakis? What is up, bro? Two years for Milanakis, dude. What is up? And look at this. We got comic book men's Ming Chen. And, we got and fucking Kevin Smith. How's that comic book? And man? Kevin yeah. Smith's comic, comic book man. How's that comic book man? Mike, get in here. We need everyone. Yeah, Mike, nah. <laughs> I miss you too, Milanakis. Dude, Milanakis, I miss you, bro. You're in Greece, right? You're in Greece Milanakis. right now? Yeah. Uh, the Mil Super Bowl is... Can we, can we say, say it anymore? Say it anymore. Yeah, can't say yeah. it anymore. There he is, everybody. Uh, Mike Zapsic, everybody. Elder there he is another comic book man. <laughs> Very nice, dude. I hope you're having... Yeah. Look at it. It's everyone from comic book men and from... Muses stream. Look at this. Uh, uh, this is so awesome. And Andy's in here. Andy's in Greece, but is uh, doing lots of IRL stuff. Yeah, I miss you too, bro. I hope. When do you get back? How long you gone for? What is going on? Three months. Wow. Okay. Wow. Back in September. Wow. 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 That's when I get back too. I leave here September uh, second. Well, I don't know when I leave. The, the, we're done shooting in September second, so probably like the fourth or something like that. But that's, yeah, that's when I'll be back too. How awesome. Yeah, we're going to be here shooting Clerk 3, as you can see. Definitely, bro. Definitely. Let's let's definitely do, um, we should do a a cool, I mean, I guess I don't know if it would work. I was going to say we could do like, when you're out in the world of Greece, I could be out in the world of Red Bank. We could co-stream, talk to each other somehow. I don't know how that works. But I do. But you definitely got to hit me up as soon as you get back, my friend. I miss you. I love your face. What a great, look at that. At the same time, we had Milanakis, Mike, Ming, Smith, Muse. Love, thank you, Anders. You're the best, bro. You are the best. Tell the family I said hello. Yeah, uh, Andy, I'm in red. We're in the secret stash right now. So yeah, I've been here. I've been coming here every morning, uh, Andy. I try to get here at like 6 a.m. and then go to like uh, noon, one o'clock. And then I go, Logan's here, Jordan's here, Grandma's here. So it's dope. Right away, Andy, right away. I went right away and got a pork leg and cheese. And then I had to go get some White Castle. Oof, yummy, it's so good. I've been literally, that's the one thing I've been really thinking about almost more than anything else is White Castle. But the pork leg and cheese is, a, is definitely, it's so good. So it's a, a, a it's meat, Lasden, um, egg, and, and a cheese and salt, pepper, ketchup on a hard roll. And it's so yummy. It's so good. What are you doing, Ming? You're streaming where? Over there at the counter. Oh my goodness. Yeah, freaking. So, uh, oh. Facebook.com slash 
Uh, Ming, Ch Ming Chen. Yeah, stealing his, he's stealing his viewers. Get out of here. Well, I don't know if you're gonna be able to do. Yeah, reverse I don't, raid. I don't know if you could do that. Well, wait, wait, I don't know if you could do that though, because it might mess with my internet. Come it on, might, we got a hundred, we got hundred, hundred megabit uploads, dude. You'll be no, fine. No, 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 it's five hundred uploads. Okay, but it's even better. Four hundred, four hundred. Okay, uploads. they're even better. I should have said. You don't know anything about computers or internet, bro. Come yeah, on. I've, yeah, I've, you know, I've made a touch <laughs> of computer once or twice. I think it'll be fine. Uh, <laughs> snooch. So I'm doing this. I was telling most people, I didn't tell Andy this. This is what I'm doing right now, Andy. Oh, yeah. It's really hard. I'm having a hard time, man. I've been thinking about food all day and night. Last night I thought about food so much. The wife did it, so I told her I would try it, so... Let me tell you something, kids. It's all good, Andy, because that didn't. Oh, you know what? I thought she's a bathroom. Will you steal my seat? I will. Sorry. Oh. Hold on. Andy J. Love Fest. Talk to everybody. Um, I guess I should sit in the chair like a normal person. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. This feels powerful. What up, kids? It's your old pal, Silly Bill. Isn't this cute? He, he replicated his streaming thing at the stash. Although now it's like, we should dress some of this shit to camera. I'm gonna turn that rack around so people see what's being sold. I, uh, I, he, you know, he's talking about his cleanse. I'm fasting right now. And if people are, if anybody out there is anorexic or bulimic, trigger warning, I'm gonna talk about fasting. Um, I am on hour, I don't know if you can see that, 79 of a fast. That's 79 hours uh, without eating. So, uh, well, just water. I just drink water, that's it. And hiking. Been hiking in our own, our old hometown of Highlands every morning and every night. And uh, I feel great, not hungry. My body is literally eating itself right now. All the stored food I'd been packing away, some fucking cake, fucking lot of refried beans, I'm sure. A lot of hummus, probably. Um, but let's be honest, more of the sugar that's just been stored away. So I'm, I'm burning it off while I'm walking, and when I'm not walking, I'm just letting my body eat it, eat itself. Uh, some misinformed cats out there be like, your muscles, it's eating your muscles. It's not. Also, I don't have any muscles to begin with to eat, so ha ha ha. Right now, I'm in a state of autophagy, where my body is healing and repairing itself uh, in a way that it can't when you eat three meals a day, and that's no shade or criticism. Please, if you can eat three meals a day, enjoy. I used to eat five, and it put me in a place where uh, I had a massive heart attack and almost died. So yeah, trying to, to uh, take care of me. So in autophagy, all these dead cells that hang around your body and stuff get scraped off the surface. You, your body creates stem cells you know, stem cells, the things that make you know, po politicians fucking mad. Or like, stem cells are fucking from babies and shit. Your body can still produce stem cells, but it happens only when you're kind of in a state of autophagy. And that's because the body's not consuming, digesting, going through that process, which we're, you know, we do three times a day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and sometimes more than that with snacks. But we're not built that way. Don't, I, and also, mind you, you're taking health advice from fucking Silent Bob, so take it with a grain of salt. And everything I know, I learned on the internet, so take that with a grain of salt as well. But, you know, we're, we were hunter-gatherers, man. Like, we didn't have access to food all the time. So our bodies are built for, for fat storage to, you know, take care of us when we can't get to food. But now, we, you know... It's tough to not get to food, uh, you know, unless you're kind of, uh, you're food destitute or what's, I can't remember what the term is. I guess not everyone can get to food. I guess that's an overstatement. But for those of us who can get to food, you know, propaganda of commercials over and over again, breakfast, you gotta have a breakfast. You gotta have lunch, dinner with a family and stuff like that. So we're not built to eat that often. And those of us who can't stop love eating and stuff and then once we turn it on we just more i'll sit there and watch a two-hour movie and eat throughout the whole thing and i don't mean like popping popcorn in the movie theater 
I mean, like I will spread out a buffet and just consume for two hours. Human beings aren't supposed to do that. It's like grazing like a cow for heaven's sakes. So yeah, man, uh, you know, I've done a lot of damage to my body over the course of 50, almost 51 years. In two weeks, I'll be 51 on August 2nd when we start shooting Clerks 3. Um, so yeah, this is me just kind of going through my version of a of his his cleanse, the high frequentia full body detox guide. That's how he's approaching it. I'm approaching it in a, a much more um, primal, organic fashion. Just not eaten. Um, and again, trigger warning for those who have eating disorders um, or have experienced eating disorders. Uh, some feel that could classify what I do as an eating disorder. I certainly don't. Uh, but um, yeah, that's kind of what works for me. So it's almost 80 hours in. I think I'm going to go to, well, five days is 120 hours. Six days is 144. And seven days, which I've never done, is 168. So I might do that and then break my fast with this tomato soup I've had my eye on for the last three days. It's funny the shit that when you deny yourself eating what you crave and this fucking vegan tomato soup I've been looking at in the closet for the last three days going like, we will fuck. Oh yes. I'm going to put you in my mouth. Um, so that's probably how I'll break my fast. Now, let me, uh, let me, let me see what everyone's saying. Cause I've just rambled. Uh, I saw one that said Kev's midlife crisis is about getting healthy. That was very funny. Um, how long are you gone? Will the real Kevin Smith stand up? Still here, still here. Just trying to make sure there's less of them so I could stick around. Gotta finish clerks three. You know what I'm saying? This is the reason I survived that fucking heart attack is that I can make clerks three and we're here. We're like less than two weeks away from starting. But so I want to make sure I live through that and then live through posting it and then getting it out. We're going to take it out on tour probably like we did with reboot. So while I'm doing all that, I want to make sure I'm alive. Then after that, I might eat myself into an early grave. We'll see with vegan food. That's the problem. With the, be, I'm vegan. Don't get turned off by that. I'm just plant based. I had to do that because of my heart attack. But um, I had so much cholesterol in me. I was more cholesterol than man. More fucking chicken fat than man. That's what the doctor said. Look at him. He's more little Debbie than Big Kev. <laughs> That's a funny line. I just wrote that right now. Copyright Kev Smith. I looked around to make sure Ming and Mike ain't here to steal that joke. Um, so, uh, yeah. So I, I went vegan, uh, plant-based, if you will, to cut down all, on all that cholesterol, which is great. It helped save my life. Problem is sugar is also vegan. So that gets in. I wish sugar wasn't vegan. I wish they were like, sugar is as bad as, you know, fucking pig fat. You might as well eat a fucking pig's asshole. Then I'd be like, all right, no more fucking sugar for me. But, you know, in vegan world, sugar is still plant-based, right? Comes out the ground. Don't come from an animal's asshole. So, you know, you can make some tasty fucking shit with some sugar, man. The guy I went to this fantastic fucking vegan bakery restaurant in Neptune uh, City, which is over like about 25 minutes from the stash called Cat's Luck Vegan. Let me tell you something, kids. Holy shit. Delicious fucking food and all treats like ch these chocolate fucking Chico stick cookies, fucking oatmeal pies, like little Debbie style, but thicker and, you know, not and vegan cream and shit. This is brownies, chocolate cake. Oh, even thinking about it, I'm getting a little hard and a little wet, if you can believe that. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's all it's vegan, but it's all fattening as well, you know, and all, you know, th things in moderation. But the problem with some of us is, you know, once you start, once you turn on the trigger, you don't turn on the trigger. What the fuck? Once you 
flip the switch. We'll go with that one. It's tough to fucking put the hungry, hungry hippo back in the cage, man. He's just like, yum, yum, yum. Did you ever watch Game Changers on Netflix about veganism? Yes, I did. It's very, very good. Uh, are we getting something similar to Red State soon? I love that movie. No, that was pretty serious. But I've been, I've been kind of like side hustle writing this horror movie about Satanism that uh, could be Red Statey. One of my favorite movies of all time, Race with the Devil, about a bunch of Satanists chasing these people in a Winnebago. So I, you know, before I leave this world, I'm, I wanna make a fucking Satanic movie. One of those movies where a cult is after some fuckers instead. Shani Needs Love says, is Harley gonna be part of the production? Uh, she is, not as much as she was in Reboot, but she is definitely pops up in Clerks 3 as well. Uh, but Austin, her boyfriend, he plays a big part in the movie. He was in our Son in Lockdown show that we did last year this time on TBS. Zombie Deadpool says, Kev, you and Jay are like idols, my idols, and made me want to start working towards doing something I love for a living, so thank you. Good. That's what y'all need to do, kids, is fucking make sure you do something for a living that makes you happy. I tell my kid all the time, figure out what you love to do, and then figure out how to get paid for it. Thank God the kid wasn't like, you know what I love to do, old man? Fuck. I'd be like, well, my advice went awry. Um, which apparently what she loves to do is act, and so she's acting now. My Romeo says, once upon a time in Hollywood was fire. Harley Quinn was in that too. Legend already, 100%, he says, thank you. Yeah, she was in that. She was in a Quentin Tarantino movie. She's already better than me. I was never in a Quentin Tarantino movie. Seen a bunch, saw Pulp Fiction before anybody else did at a secret screening in Cannes in 1994. Yeah, top that. Um, but no, I never, my kid topped it by being in a Quentin Tarantino movie. She said, hold my beer, old man. And then she went and fucking was in one of his flicks. So my kid's better than me. What do you want me to tell you? Tried to raise her to be worse than me. Didn't pan out. She just, she's ascended. Just, we thought she'd execute, she elevated. Every time I'm like, hey, I saw Pulp Fiction when it first premiered in Cannes. She's like, oh yeah, I was in Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Silent Bill. I'm like, Silent, Silent Bob. That's it. Uh, we thank you uh, for tolerating this interruption. We now return you to your regu reg regularly, regularly <laughs> scheduled broadcast. What a treat that was, huh? Yesterday we had a, uh, some boys pop in, right? Um, they're on a road trip. That was awesome. We did just chatting for two hours. We played some games um, Today we had Mike Ming Kevin pop in and then Kevin also chatted Where can you get all these? You know pop-ins and look at that. Look at that. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Kevin decided to drink Cup of Joe. Oh, just Cup of Joe hit too fast as he runs to the restroom <laughs> And now he's on the shooter Biggs is here. Biggs oh, is gonna take Biggs. over for a minute, y'all. <laughs> yeah. 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 Sco you can scooch up and stuff. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Biggs, what's up, buddy? Hello. 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 Biggs, ready up. <laughs> ready up, Biggs. Let's do it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready up, Biggs. Do it. Do it. Do it. Let's do this. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. He's a natural. <laughs> Let's go. Here we go, Biggs. Oh crap! There was a lot of people here. No excuses, Biggs. Kill them all. They're done. Jimmy! Bastards. What happened? No, thanks! Found! I'm scared. Found, I'm scared. One sound. Use your gun wisely. Get off of him! They were everywhere. I'm sorry! 
Run! This is how I'm gonna change you. Throw me at him! I'll bite his ankles! Throw me at him! I get my card first. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. Run! Don't even look over here, guy. Yeah, no, no, walk away. Go the other way. Don't come this way. Oh, jeez. <laughs> you don't see nothing. <laughs> No, you shot me no! Run. I'm running! One more and you oh, there's a medkit right there! I should have grabbed it! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> We're doing it! Full send! Full send, let's go! Alright, Biggs, where to next? Nope. Nope. You're controlling the, the, you're the, you leader the character. Of the pack. You're the good shot caller. Yeah. You do what the muse says. And you're currently the muse, so. I'm just gonna pick a random spot. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta just be close coach. Your eyes and I'm pretty sure that's what I'm pretty sure that's what Jay does anyway. So just close your eyes and point <laughs> in a direction. No, yeah, that's Frederick! Yes. No! He was a good chicken. <laughs> no, he wasn't. How do you know? You didn't even give him a chance. Mmm, crispy. Don't touch his corpse. Get on the lawn, the controls of this. No, stop it. You're fine. Left trigger aims, right trigger shoots. That's all you need to know. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I got several people on me. Um, Where are you at? Oh, Jim has a full team on him. Hello. Oh, hi, hi, Jim. They are actually coming in. Dude, I'm getting shot from people like are of for sure everywhere. Oh no. Yeah, Jim. Uh Hi. ran away and there's like more guys. <laughs> different team. Jim! It's for shitty shakes. Ah! No! Thanks! They're trapping right on me. I got a little bit. Because they're scanning. Because they're scanning. Powers combined. With our powers combined. We, got these two. we gotta get cards. Oh no, they can see us! Ah, get out of here. Let's go, Jim. Oh my. No, found guy. What? Look at that. I don't no, like no, Jay. Like we, we've won like several games. No, yeah, no, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Get dark. <laughs> Get dark. <laughs>